the first entirely digital election in the world, and it is up to us to make it run smoothly. I'm sorry, my profile doesn't seem to be working. It's not just you, sweetie. Auto mass transit is offline, mostly infrastructure. Vic, they're coming from everywhere. The whole country is shutting down. Uh, we're doing everything we can, Prime Minister. I think we found her. I didn't do anything wrong. You have to believe me. This is what I need you to see. You said you wanted to start a revolution. It sucks. Doesn't it? <laughs> you are visible. Have good life in jail. We have the guilty party in custody. One, Adam Cole. You're looking for Yannick. What is that? Can we track it? What? It came from here? Wait, whatever. We can still pull it off. I've used Pandora's box. Nobody has anything on me. Wait, wait. No, no. I've got a lock, Captain. Wait. It's gone. What just happened? I'm not sure. The anomaly got replaced by an identity. I have it. Here it is. Can you fake an official profile? Is it possible? In theory, but wow. This profile has a history dating back decades. Schools, work, medical, everything. This is hardcore, sir. Can you find out where she's going? She recently paid for an airline ticket. We should scramble off some units and cut her off. Captain? Captain! Vector me on an intercept, Lieutenant, and have SWAT beat me there. We need somebody that already has access. We know someone. Stand by for details. to the airport. And just like that, South Slovenia switched back on. It's good to be back. This case proved that organized cyber attacks remain the greatest threat of the modern world. Criminals can impact a country's cyber security rating, they can cause economic crisis, they can even bring down governments. Securing the joins between networks, applications, and services remains the greatest challenge of modern times. The case for universal adoption has taken a severe blow. In the wake of the great switch-off, only time will tell how South Slovenia will fare. A new government in South Slovenia. PM Carrington lost the postponed elections after the opposition accused him of causing the so-called switch-off with the intent of jury-rigging the elections. It was the worst day of my life. The tool of our advancement became a noose around my neck. There's no alternative to technological development. No matter what the risk, it's worth it. I'm happy to retire quietly, offline. I can't say too much. You understand. Diplomatic immunity is just that. History will remember my contributions and forgive my failings. We are only human after all. Will we be able to draw the right conclusions? I'm afraid that now, when everything seems fine, people will soon forget what led to this tragedy. And 
poof, she's gone. It was a hostile act on behalf of a hostile nation, but who was she working for? They're hiding something, that's pretty clear. I don't know if we'll ever know the truth. I would advise extreme caution, for we all know what killed the cat. And Curiosity's claws are sharp. Would you like to know more?